ng narinig, patuloy tayong mag-long. Diba? Yung heart na longing tayo sa presence ng Panginoon. Sabi ng Isaiah 26.9 At night, my soul longs for you. Indeed, my spirit within me seeks, seeks you diligently. For when the earth experiences your judgment, the inhabitants of the world learns righteousness. At night, my soul longs for you. Gaano tayo nagsinaglulong sa patuloy na presensya ng ating Panginoon. Ganun na sabi natin hindi, no? Lord, taas, nakita mo, bukas ang kalangitan, pero ilan lang ang nagtataas ng kamay. And we all believe, raising our hands is a way of asking, Lord, I need you. Lord, I long for you. Kaya, sa biyaya ng kabutihan ng Panginoon, kung dito parang sa lupa, hindi na natin may taas ang ating mga kamay para sa Panginoon. Ano pa sa kalangitan? Ika nga eh, kung dito practice to sa tingin ng tao, ito ay paraan na tinitingnan talaga tayo. I believe by faith, sa bawat gawain, sa bawat ginagawa natin, ang Lord laging nakatunghay. Lagi yan nakamasid. Lagi yan tayong tinitingnan. Kaya nga tayo nakakatanggap ng protection eh. Amen? So the Lord always long for the praises of His people. And we long, always long, for the move of the Holy Spirit to our lives. Sabi ng Lord sa Isaiah 11, as it, as it is written, the Spirit of the Lord shall rest upon me, the Spirit of wisdom and understanding, the Spirit of counsel, and the mind of the spirit of knowledge and of the fear of the Lord and He will delight in the fear of the Lord. Di ba nakita natin, no? Ganun yung ating tinatanggap when the spirit of the living God continue move into our lives. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We'll sing our praises to the Lord. Our prayers to the King of Kings. And to the Lord of Lords, no other name but the name of Jesus. As He promised to us that after He died, risen again, and ascended to heaven, God would send the Holy Spirit to live inside His people. And Jesus is faithful to His promise. And so God,
and that reminds you of us, dear God. Continue, Lord, to be a mind of Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, thank you for the wonders, the signs, and the miracles that you're doing in our lives. Thank you for the healing and restoration, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for continuing to reveal your goodness for us, Father Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for the heavens declares your glory, Father Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Father. Lord, sa gabing ito, patuloy mo po, Lord, kami kausapin. Patuloy mo kami palakasin, Lord. Patuloy mo kami i-encourage, Father Lord. For you said, Lord, to Joshua, be strong and very courageous, because I'll be with you wherever you go. Thank you, Jesus. We will not be discouraged. We will not be afraid. We will not be fear, Lord God. What we have is only the fear of the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Father, so let us be to in the name of Jesus through the power of your Holy Spirit. Continue, Lord, to give us your words, Panginoon. The words that give us, Panginoon, Lord God. A, a heart, Panginoon. For changes, Panginoon, Lord God. That you change our faith to continue to stand strong, Panginoon. And continue, Lord God, to transform us, Panginoon. Thank you, Jesus. We believe, Father God, that in every day of our lives, you are here, Lord God. And we know, Lord, in your presence, Lord, there is freedom and liberty. And your power, if it will come, Panginoon, it will give us, Panginoon, Lord God, our, a strong transformation, Lord God. Thank you, Jesus. Lord, sa gabi ng ito, pinapala, we magnify your name, we adore your name. Give you thanks, Father, the honor, the glory, the highest praises, the highest worship, the power to love, the dominion, the kingdom. It all belongs to you, Father God in heaven. And all this always we ask and pray in the mighty name of Jesus, our Lord, our Savior, and through the power, the guidance, the teaching, the preaching, and the counsel of the Holy Spirit. Amen and amen. Glory to God.